Hey folks, it's Rithgar here. How you doing? Welcome back to House Flipper. We are going to continue on doing some of the jobs, I think, today before we buy our first property. I would very much like to get into buying property, uh, but I figure that we'd be better off if we go and get some jobs first. Now, there is some dirt showing on this map, so we're going to do something about this. Uh, mainly, it's on the ceiling. It seems to be the, the, the main culprit is up on the ceilings all the way around. See, there's a, a cobweb up there. That's now gone. And there's more dirt there up on the ceiling. Right, that seems to be all of it. So let me just, um, hang on, let me get rid of that one. Nope, you go that way to get rid of it. Right, so we're going to here. This game should now be available for all of you. You should be able to do all of it. Uh, save me from these horrible colors, honey. Student's house to clean and additional walls. This is a custom building. I need some alterations made to my two-room house. My daughter is now three and we feel easy time she has her own room. Please divide the bedroom into two rooms. Make sure the new rooms both have doors that connect to the corridor. Could you please also put in a new bed and remove the crib? Yours faithfully, Thomas Johnson. Now then, we got to mount two devices, modify some walls and do some fur oh, furnish room as well. So let's just come into here. Where is it that we're going to be working? I see. Right, so we've got a little box room here, which, quite frankly, I think could be bigger. Um, and then we've got this room over here, which, quite frankly, I don't really know what the people were thinking when they built this place, because it, it just seems wrong. So very wrong on so many levels. So there's a line there. I'm guessing that's actually where we're going to be, put, be putting this. Uh, we need to sell that cot. That one we can sell. Can we sell this one? I'm not that kind of guy. Apparently I'm not the kind of guy that sells... I don't want to earn money this way. Apparently stealing little children's um, belongings is not the way that we are going to be behaving in life. This, this is not what we're going to do. Right, so let's close that one. We'll come in here and we will close that one. So we don't need to buy any more doors. We just need to beat our way out of this one. There we go. So we just start coming through like this. I'm hoping... This will allow us to escape. No, it's not actually going to allow us to escape. But uh, as soon as some of them start to disappear, then it, it makes life a little bit easier. There we go. Look at that. And uh, we take that one out. And that one. And boom! Out goes that lot. That is absolutely brilliant. And then we can start... But Ooh. Um, I think I've done some <laughs> damage to their wardrobe over there. Uh, to the chest of drawers. And... and and maybe the kids' toys as well are not going to be quite so healthy as they once were. Um, let's just ignore that, shall we? Let's, let's just pretend that we didn't have anything to do with it. So we've done that bit. The next bit that we need to do is, well, we need to buy a bed to go in there. But we also, here, we want to build some walls. So we want to build a wall right there. That's where we got... Is that where we got to build the first one? Oh, no. It's not on that line there, it's on that bit there. If you look on the map, you, on the mini-map, you can see it's, it's showing up. We've got to do it where the green line is. Ooh, that takes a long time. Right, there's not enough room to place this wall here. Yeah, we got that one there. And we do one here. So we, we've just got to come along and just keep placing these walls down through here like this. There we go. And the next one. Right, we're doing quite well with this. This it's, it's relatively simple, to be honest. That red line there, that was there. It was put there deliberately to try to, like, put us off and um, make make life a little bit difficult for us. I'm sure of it. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. I won't put that one there. I won't put it there. I'm absolutely positive that is the only reason they put it there. So I'm going to move this one over by two, and I'm going to do that just in case I want to be able to, like, move in between them. Um... Okay, I'll put that one there. And what's going to happen if I don't put it there is I'm going to end up um, like making a mistake and not lining it up properly. New building skills available. Let's press tab a minute. Uh, building, right. We can go faster building. Can build three walls at once, five walls at once, maximum amount of walls in a line. The built wall is already painted. Building distance is a meter more. 50% lower building, but 50% faster, but three walls at once. Three walls at once. Oh, definitely. Right, so how do we do this? Uh, there's three walls at once. What? How do I build three walls at once? It's lied to me. It lied to me. 
I'm not building three walls at once. How am I supposed to build three at once? I don't understand. Put that one in there. And build that. And now I want to do this here. Start doing that. No, that didn't build three walls at once. Okay, so I have I have been absolutely one hundred percent lied to. That was that was all wrong, right? Um, no, I can't. I cannot build three walls at once. You you lied to me. You absolutely lied. Look, see, it it doesn't. Um, build walls five. If I go. If I click there, it doesn't do it. It doesn't. Right. Okay. Well, we'll just ignore that bit. Right. Uh, I need to place an object, and there's a task in another room. So we need to place an object in here first. We want to go to the store. We want a grill bed. So we're going here, and I will just type in grill. There we go. Bed grill. That one right there. And we'll buy that one just as it is. We won't make any changes to it whatsoever. And, you know, really, we would... Actually, we want to put this one over here. Let's, let's, let's... It's a little girl's room. We're not going to... We're not going to just dump her bed out anywhere. Um, we're, we're not... We're not those kind of people. So, we've got that one done there. Room furn... Why is it saying zero room furnished? The th I've, I've done the furnishing of the room. Why has it got zero? Tasks in other rooms. Mount devices. There's a device to mount in here. Tasks in other rooms, one of two. Right, well, let's just assemble this one a minute. There's something wrong with that bed. We've placed that bed down, and they've got a problem with it. So we'll just uh, quickly do this electrical socket. We've got two more jobs to do, at least. There's one with a cleaning up a student's house, which I suspect is going to be rather grotty. And then there's another one with... Um, I don't remember now. What was the other one? Oh, painting. There was a load of painting. There was more painting that we needed to do. She, um, there was someone, it's, uh, someone about don't like these colours, honey, or something like that. So she, th there was a, I'm guessing it was a woman that didn't like the colours. Because, I mean, I've, I've been called honey quite a few times by different people. Um, never by a man. Actually, no, I haven't. I, I, I'm pretty sure that's just something that women say. Um, I could be wrong. I could be completely wrong on this. But it, it's, I, I don't remember ever being called honey by a man. Um, so it's just, I guess it's a, 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 a woman thing, is it, maybe? Uh, right, it says, tasks in other rooms, zero of one. So where's the other task? I've got another task in another room. Mount devices. Oh, living room. Oh, we got one over here somewhere. Where is it? Is it that one? No, it's not that one. It's here. To pick up. It's behind, it's, it's behind there. We've got to remove that one, I think. There it is. Found it. Right, we want to go assemble. There we go. We've got to do that one right there. So we can take that one off. Remove that one there. We've done the furniture thing. The furniture thing was done. Here we go. Take that one out. And that one as well. And then pull this one out. And then we can start working on the back. We're going to do that one. And see, if you do that one, if you do it in order, it then goes back to this one over here, and then it comes down, let's do the screw. So I put that one up there as well, and I put that screw in, and it, it um, saves the camera, it saves the time where the camera just kind of slowly wiggles backwards and forwards. And we put that one in there, do that one up, and do that one up as well, and then we can put the faceplate back on, the brand new faceplate, I might add. And there we go. And now we have job done. Complete order. I can complete the order. I ought to really put this one back. Um, am I even going to be able to do that? No. I am not able to put it back. And I don't know why. I can put it there. There. <laughs> okay, I have no idea why it's not letting me do that. But it's not. Right, 3,100. Okay, complete. I don't mind getting 3,100. Achievement unlocked first money. I don't know why it's first money. We've already done. We've, we've already earned monies. We've, we've earned lots of monies already. Okay. We go back inside and let's see what the next order is. Have we still got... Oh, we got four now. These orders are coming in thick and fast. Open. Right. Necessary extra bathroom. Bathroom and home workshop. Student's house to clean up. Save me from these horrible colors. Honey. Michael Brand. Okay. I got that wrong. Um. Back... 
Nick Flo. There, student's house this is the next one. I hope you can help me. I am retired and not in the best of health. I currently own an apartment that I've been renting to students for many years. This year, unfortunately, I rented a bad bunch of students, which turned out not to be the best decision. They didn't pay on time, so I went to check things out. When I opened the door, I almost had a heart attack. The whole house was a pigsty. There was trash, liquor bottles, and mud everywhere and they were laying on the kitchen floor drinking when i spoke to them they rudely told me to go away i finally got them evicted but the mess still remains some of the furniture and radiators are missing can you please clean up my house and make it suitable for new tenants so i can put this mess behind me yours sincerely nick flo <laughs> Whoa. okay looks like we got a bit of work to do right we need to clean dirt remove trash destroy the cockroach nest Mount devices, clean the window, paint rooms. This could take a bit of doing. Right, we have done this room. Let's just go to here, clean. Where do I need to clean? There's, uh, there's some cleaning to do around the door, is there? I haven't cleaned anything. Oh, there's some dirt up there. Um, some more dirt. The, the, there's supposed to be some dirt near me, and I don't know where it is. I'm 33% on clean dirt at the moment. I reckon it's going to be one of those where we can't actually find the dirt. It's going to be missing dirt. Missing in action. Let's open the door. Do I, do I really want to open this door? This is going to be something that I regret to my dying day, isn't it? Okay, um, let's start disposing of a few things in here. We'll get rid of that. Um... Okay, there's a lot of bottles here. We had a perk where all um, items near where you click uh, all disappear at once. And it's really useful for things like the bottles. It, it makes a huge difference. I can't get that one. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move that one over there. And now I can reach it. Right, that's better. And then we want to just go through and get all of those. Like that. So we've removed the trash. We need to go back to cleaning again in here. There we go. Right, We yeah, we have got a faster cleaning perk now, haven't we? So that is going to make a bit of a difference. So we'll just keep going through here. We've done 50% of the dirt in this room so far. But some patches on the floor always tend to be a little bit stubborn. We, we are aware of that. And then there's a piece up there. There, I reckon that's... This room here is now clean. It was because we had to get it from the other side. It was actually... The bit up there, it was actually being counted from the other side rather than this side. So, 77% uh, dirt. That one's all done. 88%. I got more dirt in here still. Where is it? Oh, it's up there. Look, we got some up there and we got some up there. Clean dirt is now 100%. Okay, so then we've got mount devices and clean window. So, we can do the cleaning of the window. We've got this little old um, mini game that you have to do for cleaning windows. And bring that down like that. It does do strange things. There we go. Can you hear this all right? Um, and sometimes it seems like quiet, and other times it seems a bit loud. Um, I'm just wondering if I should alter the settings a little bit more for you so you can hear it a bit better. There we go. Right, there's that one. Let me alter it a minute. Right, the music is just turned up just a little bit, so you might be able to get a bit more from it. Um, now, we want installations, and we want a radiator, so we buy that one, and we will plonk that one on there, and we will assemble, and then this room will be complete. We will have done two rooms so far in this grotty, grotty student house. Um, also, in the comments section, I would like to hear from you today. Would you like me to just keep playing through these various different jobs until we've sort of completed the list of different jobs that are available? Or do you want me to hurry up and get a move on and buy a house? Because um, I know some of you will like the jobs. Others of you would rather I just bought a house and we started um, getting onto our own creativity. Uh, not really sure what's going on there. Um, we've got a whole load of old newspapers and... Why would you sleep? It, it, look at this. this. This room is an absolute pigsty. Um, remove trash. Paint white. Yeah, this this, this room was um, definitely someone who prefers darker shades. And that's uh, remove trash. Where's the rest of the trash? Is that trash? No. Hold to pick up. Where is it? Is that it? Oh, press to dispose. Right. Oh, there we go. I was walking uh, I was walking around on it. Right, so we didn't want the poster in here. So now we can go to cleaning. 
And this is going to be a bit of a problem. It's a bit more difficult to see the dirt in here. We've got a window to clean. Two windows to clean in here. There goes the dirt on the floor. The ceiling actually seems all right. Uh, there's some, there, yeah, there's a lot of dirt around that window there. A lot of dirt around that window. And then we've obviously, we've got this, this bed here as well. 80% of clean dirt. We've got the graffiti on the walls. There we go. So we've cleaned all dirt. I need to clean the window. We'll do both of those next. Right. Uh, yeah, this, this is the this is the one bit that it doesn't sort of seem to to flow very easily. I mean, it's it's actually getting better. I noticed that before I started recording today, there was another update. I didn't actually read the patch notes. Um, I probably should have done. Uh, but I'm assuming that it's changed the way that the window thing operates because it definitely does operate a little bit more smoothly this time. Bring that down there. Yeah, I, I reckon that they've done some work on the, the whole cleaning window thing. It's, it's still not brilliant, just the way that it moves around, but it's definitely better than it was. Go up through and get that little bit there. There's a piece up there that we missed. I certainly couldn't earn a living from cleaning windows. I don't think anybody would actually pay me for my efforts for cleaning windows. It is a little bit grim. There's one more little bit in there. Oh, there we go. Okay, apparently that's clean enough. We don't need to worry about it anymore. There's those done. Uh, mount devices, which is... A re Ooh, excuse me, I've got the hiccups again. Right, paint with white. We will do... We will do painting next. We'll go there, and we will buy paint. And we will scroll down. We want white this time. I think that's right at the bottom, isn't it? Yes, there we go. Right, uh, buy now. Place that one down there. Now, I, I'm curious, in our perks section, uh, building painting, 370. Cleaning 200 and another 245, and we'll be able to do something there. Uh, I'm thinking that see most dirt in the minimap is the next one we'll do on that one. Then we go through to painting. Now, I've gone with the 20% less paint usage, and we're now painting two walls at a time. I think 25% faster painting will be the next one, but we've got to do 370 lots of painting before we're actually able to qualify for that, which is, um, which is not great. Well, apparently those are already painted, so it's only these bits here. When the student came along and painted his room, he couldn't be bothered to actually uh, paint the rest of it. It was it was just too much like hard work for the poor precious soul to come through and uh, you know paint the whole wall. Um, so it, you, the bits around the windows, it was just too much for him. He couldn't cope with it. So in the end, he decided not to do it, and he went and left it white right around the windows and then he's gone for the black elsewhere so bring that through like that all the way underneath oop steady suck that one up and then we get another lot through here there we go is that done i think that's done yes that is done and then we can get those bits up there i wonder how much painting i'm gonna have to do in this house It'll be interesting to see, was it? it was 370 that we had when we started this room. So I'm curious to see how much we get painted. Uh, well, how, yeah, how, how many sections of paint we do before we finish this room. And then we can sort of see how long we got before we get our next perk. And we're definitely going for faster painting next. I think we'll work through faster painting on all of it. If we do that, because the, the longer handle... That's that doesn't really make much of a difference. It just means that you got to um, you don't have so far to walk. But I think faster painting next would definitely speed things up because I mean having the two sections is pretty good. It is better if you can have three sections, but that's not going to speed it up as much as faster painting would. Faster painting would definitely be a better option for us right now than um, having like four sections of wall. And then also, right, that's, oh, that's done. Yeah, okay. And then we want to go back in. So we've got 300 to go. So we did 70 pieces. We've got another 300 sections of painting to go before we're finished. That's going to take us a while. Let's get that radiator there and stick that one on the wall. Assemble. At least the radiators are very quick to mount up. Put that one on there and there. And then we can mount that one onto there and there. And we have done another room. That is two rooms complete. 
Although, technically, the first room, you, you, I don't suppose you could really count the first room because it was over so fast and so quickly, it sort of didn't really make much difference. Now, we come into this room. Uh, this is a long, narrow room that's got some trash. Remove trash. There we go. I finished. I finished already. I am that good at this job. Right, we will go through and we will clean that and then that bit there. So we're 17% clean on dirt. There's going to be stuff around the doors. Uh, that's moving in there. That is actually cockroaches. That is beginning to make my skin crawl a little bit. Um, and we don't have, yeah, uh, I, I, I'm not really sure that I, I want to be looking at all of those. This, um, th that's pretty grim. That is pretty disgusting and grim to have a huge, great big cockroach nest scurrying around the floor like that. It just, yeah, ooh, there. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like, I don't like it at all. Uh, we got a little bit of mold and mildew around the bottom here. A little bit there. Uh, seventy percent on cleaning dirt. Is that all we've got? There's got to be some more here. We're on to eighty-eight percent, ninety-four percent. Is trying to find where the dirt is all the way around the bottom. Um, is that some up there? Does it actually show up when, if you like, mouse over it? Does it? Does it show up? It doesn't seem to be anything on the mini-map, but it's saying 94%. So I'm curious. Where it's, it's difficult to see where dirt is in this room. Right. Um, let's do this. Let's, let's go in here. Open. Look at that. That is absolutely disgusting. Pull out the vacuum cleaner. We want a vacuum cleaner to get rid of these. That is just revolting. Oh, no. oh! Oh, look at it! Okay, I'm, I am so taking a picture of this. How, how does the picture thing work? I don't, I don't know how the picture thing works. Uh, we go to camera, like this. Can I zoom in? No. Um, click on the camera icon, use a hotkey M. There we go. Right, so then we go to our gallery. And I can have a look at this. Right, image creator. 603. Why is it 603 pounds? Oh, I see. You can make it. Uh, like you can, you can look at it later. Uh, right. Well, I really didn't want to do that because I think it may have just crashed the actual recording because it does do that when. Uh, so, don't click on open gallery folder because it closes the game. Um, close that a minute. Come out of that bit, and then let me just restart you know, check that the recording hasn't just crashed right I don't think it crashed I think we're going to be all right um just in case I, I I've taken some precautions right so we'll go through and we will pick up this various bits of trash here and also this and then we will come back and we will deal with all those cockroaches behind us I really don't like just having them sat there it um I don't know it, it just it just feels d disturbing it is disturbing to say the least Pick up some of these. There is a lot of bottles and stuff around here. What is wrong with these people? I can understand, you know, students and you know they, they have the, the need to drink. I was a student myself. I've, I've been there and I've done that, but I didn't live like this. I really didn't. This is just this is revolting. Look, <laughs> look at it. This is, this is absolutely disgusting. The cockroaches. I mean, we don't get cockroaches like this in the UK. Um, you, very occasionally you might get um, find cockroaches in the UK, but not on this kind of scale. This this is a, a um, definitely not something that we get here. Uh, at least not where I'm from, anyway. That is that is just grim. Right. Um, pull out vacuum cleaner. All right. Hold and switch to clean. Vacuum. <laughs> okay, so you actually vacuum up all the cockroaches. <laughs> oh, I feel sorry for the poor things now. I do. I mean, cockroaches, they, they are pretty resilient creatures, but I don't think they're going to uh, be very resilient to this. Enough cockroaches are eliminated. You destroyed the cockroach nest. Yeah, that's great. I'm still getting rid of them. I'm getting rid of it. You destroyed the cockroach nest. This one there. Do I get rid of them? Have I, have I annihilated it? 
Um, there's there's two there's there's two there on the floor that aren't being picked up. I love the fact that you can pick up cockroach nests like this. This uh, uh, you destroyed the cockroach nest. Let's get some more. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> Look at them go. <laughs> Let's get let's get all the rest. Let's get them all. Every single one of them. There, right. That one's gone completely. There was a couple of them running around over here. Oh, no, they're gone as well now. Right, let's go to clean there. And then we can start actually doing the cleaning as well. Look at this. Look, it's, it's all coming up shiny. We're actually going to clean this place. It's, it's, it's going to become cleaner and, like, you know, able to be lived in. Rather than just being a disgusting, repulsive, putrid pigsty. I don't really want... Yeah, it, 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 this is quite possibly the most disgusting room that I have seen yet. Take that bit out. And that bit out. I'm curious if by going along the wall here, we do actually, like, clean up the, the room next door as well. We'll find that out in a minute. Go and just get that bit on there. Some of the stains on the furniture, and well, some of the stains everywhere, they they don't they seem to like go through the walls a bit, and it's not very easy to clean up. Like this bit down here, is that cleaning? I don't even know if that's cleaning properly. We might have to move the fridge. First of all, though, well, let's go to there. Let's go in here a minute. What are we on this room? Ninety-four percent still. Ooh, is that a bit down there? Hold to clean. There we go. Right, we found the last little bit. There's one errant little tiny piece down the bottom. Uh, let's go up to here. And I will dispose of those. Oh, there's another one up there. Dispose of that one. And then this lot as well. All the way through. We've got loads of bottles here. The advantage with having all the bottles here all at once is that it gets through the whole... It burns through into the cleaning perks just a little bit faster. We go through and we pick all of these up. Each one counts. So we have a look in perks here a minute. Painting, demolition, cleaning. There we go. We've got 62 new perks to do. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 9, 10, 11. And now we've only got 51. So yeah, every single bottle does actually count, which is pretty good. I quite like that. Um, I do want to move that one out the way. I think that's uh, preventing us from cleaning properly. So then we can go to cleaning here. And I'm hoping that I can actually clean the floor. Ah, I see. Right, it's got like a very small um, area that you can mouse over to clean. Sometimes they do. Like that, what, that bit of wall there. There, if I hold the clean over, there we go. Right, so don't hold the mouse button. I, normally, I just hold the mouse button down. You just move the stuff around, and it does all the cleaning. But occasionally, it's actually better to not do that. It's occasionally better to um, not have the cleaning going. And then you can just mouse over it, and it will say hold and move to hold to clean, like that. So that bit there is coming up. It's like within range of being cleaned. And then down there, I can see hold to clean. So if you're trying to get to a bit that doesn't quite seem to work properly, uh, just try doing that. That seems to be a way around it. Seems to be a very good way around it, actually. There we go. We've got more dirt on there and a bit over there. There's a bit under... Oh, no, I got that as well. All around the floor. We've got a radiator that we've got to mount in here. There'll be a grubby window there. Round the window we want to do with this one. More on the floor. How much have we got here? The filth is, it's its just repulsive. It's absolutely repulsive. Uh, there's one big bit here in the middle somewhere. Where is the big bit right in the middle? Is it on that one? I reckon it's underneath this one. Oh, no, I've, I've cleaned it. Wherever it was, it's no longer there. And I've got, oh, no, there's a bit up there. That's, that's where it was. Uh, I'm 95% clean dirt. Oh, no, we got a, we got a load of bits down here. Round the back of the sofa, and clean dirt is now done. Uh, one window that we want to clean. So we'll do this one. This is a big window. This one's going to take us a bit longer. Let's come down through there like that. And over there. Up that side. Yeah, see, I don't, I don't like the way that it turns around part way, because it, it kind of like messes up your, your, your line that you're doing. 
There we go. Let's try just moving up and down. That's working. I'm starting. I, it, it's going to take me a long time to get used to using this thing. I'm kind of hoping that there will be a perk somewhere to make cleaning of the windows a little bit uh, easier. Maybe get a wider squeegee. A bigger squeegee for cleaning windows. That's what we want. Any devs that are watching, please, I beg of you, a bigger squeegee. And also, you know, the ability to actually have this window class as cleaned. I've, I've gone right around the edge. I think the game is crashing. I've done it. It's a double window. Maybe it doesn't like the fact that it's a double window. It might be. Uh, hmm. Maybe I've got to go slowly with it. Oh, there we go. I think I went too quickly in, so it didn't quite clean it properly over on that side. Anyway, mount devices. We've got one radiator that we've got to put onto there. Uh, cleaning. Uh, three more and I get a cleaning perk. What were we going to get with it? Um, see, oh, yeah, I wanted to see more dirt. I got 50% faster cleaning now. Seeing the dirt on the minimap really does help. That, that makes such a big difference. So we'll put that one on there like that and assemble put this one together and then we have completed another room so that is four rooms that we've done now because we've done both the hallways and we've done a room and then we've done another room which is this room and so yeah we're, we're coming along quite nicely we've got some pretty grim rooms to, to go yet though we've got um looking on it we've it, there's a bathroom I, i'm too scared to go in there. there's another one there and we've got a room there we got a room in there and then we got another one off this room here so i'm going to go into this one first open this one one two three cleaning perk cleaning perk available we got 525 to do i'm going to upgrade to see most dirt in minimap and then we will see all dirt then we can do that one there so we got one there and then one there 525 cleaning bits to do maybe i should have gone for faster cleaning maybe that would have been the way forward I don't really know. I honestly, I couldn't say right now. At, at this point in time, I honestly couldn't say. But, all of these bottles, these are going to make a significant difference. That one. And that one in there. Go on, pick them all up, pick them all up. So we had 525, uh, 477. We had nearly 50 bottles that we picked up there. So we pick up, we got, uh, we got more windows to clean in here. We've got two windows that we need to clean. We've got a load of dirt to polish up, which isn't actually going to take all that long, I don't think. Because we have got, we got 50% faster cleaning already. I did, I sort of took care of that quite early on because I felt that it would be quite useful. And I was proved to be correct. It has been quite useful. Just a little bit faster still might make life easier. But no, I still reckon that we'll stick with the whole... How much? Where we got? We got three. Oh, it's here. Oh, yeah, that's pretty grim. Um, and are we do yeah, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. Uh, so let's go clean the window there, and we're back to this little mini game. So we're gonna come round here. But apparently, going too fast may have been what did it. So I've got, I've gone fast up there, and I'll do it slow next to it. And we'll be able to run a comparison. Can we see any difference? I can't really see any difference at all. So I'm not sure if just running the thing fast was what was causing it. Or if it was just that window was a little bit bugged maybe. It could have been. It could easily... Oh, well, that one's done. Um, we clean the next window. We can complete the order now if we want to. Or we can keep going with cleaning this grotty hovel. This absolutely disgusting, repulsive home. I kind of want to keep going. I, I am actually wanting to keep going. I've got this sick fascination now with wanting to just look at how these students have managed to live like this. I mean, what is wrong with them? Why would they want to do this to themselves? I don't get it. Uh, i got a bit more that I need to clean there. Is that going to be done? It's... Not ah, uh, there we go. Right. So I was. It it does look like you can do things just a tiny bit too fast sometimes. Uh, let's go to here. How, I forgot to look. Four hundred and forty more elements still to do. It's going to take us a little bit. Okay, we'll assemble this one. 
Fortunately, we can see right through the chair, otherwise we'd have been in a spot of bother that time. We go up to here and we'll get that one in place. There we go. And you over there. Turn it on. And we have water flowing into the radiator. So that room is done. We've done this room. All done. This room is all done. We've got two rooms there. Have I got another room out on here? No, I've done I've done two rooms in there. So we've got a bathroom, we've got a big room there, and we've got two more rooms. Oh crumbs, we got we got rooms everywhere. Okay, let's go let's go into the first bathroom. How bad is it? How bad is it? There's no trash in here. We've got to mount two devices and we've got to do a bit. This one's actually not too bad. This one's not too bad at all. We need a towel rack to go up in here. Um, sure what the other device is. Is it a sink? I don't know. Oh, yeah. It looks like we need a sink. We need to put a sink here on the wall. And other than that, it's mostly just cleaning. We've got a towel rack to put on. That one's really quick. The sink takes a little bit more time to do than the towel rack. I got a bit of cleaning over there. Right, clean dirt is done. So now I can go to mount devices and we want a towel rack this time. Mountable towel radiator, that one up there and we assemble. So we put that one in and we put the cap on. Like that, and then we put that one in that side. And we put the cap on. And then we come down the bottom and we join this one in the same as we do the other radiator. Join that one and that one there and then we do that one on there. Join it top and bottom. And then turn it on. And it is that simple. It really is that simple. So then we come down here and we need to unscrew these three so that it's ready for plumbing in the sink. And then we buy a sink and we put that one in. So we go bathroom and we go mountable sink like that. Buy and put that one on there. So then we go assemble and we put the bolts into the wall like that. And then we can put these pipes in and we can put that one in as well. Then the sink goes into place and we bolt this one on. So we put a washer. And we put a nut, and we do the same over here. A washer, there we go, and a nut, perfect. And that one, and then we do that one up. Pretty sure that doing that bit up is actually a new thing. That that wasn't on there before. I'm, I thought it was just like without. Yeah, you know, I honestly I don't remember anymore. I just I, I simply have no recollection about how that used to work. So let's just put those on. And then we put this. It, it is very, very realistic. The way that they've got all of these different aspects of it is really, really cool. I do like this. And we put that one on there and we are done. So we got the sink. So that room is now done. There's another room done. Perfect. And we can come in here. Now we've got a room with a load of trash. So we will just quickly dispose of all trash like this. Uh, what else we got? We got clean dirt, remove trash in this room. And that is it. And then we've got uh, two windows that need to be cleaned. There's some trash there. Right, trash is done. I'm going to clean the window first. I'm going to try cleaning the window first and just see if that makes a difference. There we go. Yeah, and you do actually have to go steady with this. If you go too fast, it doesn't count it. And I didn't realize that to start with. I've left a bit right at the very top there. Come back down here. Yeah, and it's not much. It's like it, you, you can barely see. If you go a little bit too slow, you can barely see what it's done. And you can barely see that it's left a bit behind. And I think that's why we've been struggling a little bit. There we go. We'll bring that one back up again. And take that out. And then there we go. Perfect. Okay, there's that window done. And I'm going to come over. I'm going to clean this window. This one's going to take a little bit longer because it's slightly bigger but again we mustn't go too insanely fast going fast that seems to be what is causing us the problems so we go all the way around the outside like that drag it back through there and then I'll just I can just start working this one up and down from this side over um, hit that bit and come up through is once we get all the way over is then I find out that I've done it just a little fraction too fast and I gotta go back over and do the whole window again because I can't quite see where I've gone too fast and where I haven't and that's what's going to cause me problems we'll see just a little bit there there we go this is actually really it's, it's difficult you wouldn't believe that I, I am genuinely struggling to keep this one going in a straight line every time it is actually difficult to keep this one going in the straight line that I desire but no I did it 
And I actually did it a lot easier than I thought I would. Let's go for cleaning next. We will just clean this one up. I don't think it's going to be a lot of cleaning that we need to do in here. I think this is actually going to be a relatively easy cleaning job. Um, because, yeah, it, maybe there was a girl in this room. Maybe there was a girl in this room and she lived slightly less of a pig than everybody else. It wouldn't surprise me. Having been a student, I often found that, um, us males were far more repulsive than the females. That they tended, they tended to keep themselves reasonably clean, whereas the, 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 the males, not quite so much. Um, ma male students are an unusual breed. Um, yeah, we, we, we want to, we want to impress the female students, but at the same time we can't be bothered to clean ourselves up enough to do so. Um, it's, it's, a, it's a strange phenomenon. It really is. And it, it kind of, it, it does die a death after, co once you leave college, it, it kind of, um, it, it becomes a thing that you no longer worry about doing. Handyman. What do we got? Um, faster plastering, faster tiling, and faster mounting. Right, well, we've done faster other things. I think we'll do some faster plastering because we'll be glad of that. And the mounting, yes, it's going to be useful to have it faster, but we don't actually need it right now. So we've got two rooms left. we got one big room here, which I think we will do next. This is quite a big room. Quite a few bits and pieces in here. There's a lot of uh, bottles. Mostly, it's, it seems to be mostly bottles in here. Let's get all of those. There's more windows to clean, more dreaded windows that we've got to clean. Uh, so let's, let's just do those windows very quickly. Um, I'm, I'm getting a little bit fed up with the windows. It was it was like a really good novelty item, but I would like to... Uh, I definitely want perks available on the whole cleaning windows that would um, make this job faster and easier. If you could get... I, I, I want a wider squeegee. That's, that's all I ask in life is a wider squeegee. If I could have a bigger squeegee, I'd be a very happy man. I would be able to do all sorts with a bigger squeegee. Like, you know... Clean the windows a bit faster. Everybody would be happy if I had a bigger squeegee. Do you, do you understand me? We just go over to this side. I See, I've, I've done it too fast again. There's a little bit there. I have to go back over all of the window again because I went over it too fast and it doesn't count. Come on. Oh, ah, there was a bit at the top. Right, okay, so I've done that one. Last window. I'm, I'm hoping that there isn't one in the bathroom that we've got to worry about. I'm, I'm, I'm really hoping that the bathroom doesn't even have a window. It's just a windowless box. Designed to trap people in there in utter misery and desperation as they try in vain to wash the filth of this dwelling from their skin and realise that they can't because, you know, they haven't actually cleaned anything else at all in this place ever and they're animals. It's, it's disgusting. Um, yeah. I don't know if they would act... I, I don't know what would go through a person's mind living in a house like this, because I've not lived in a house this bad. I lived it, you know, I, I've seen I've seen some, you know, pretty grim things, being a student. Um, but that, that was a very long time ago, and I don't remember it ever being this bad for anybody. Not, I mean, honestly, it, it, this is just this, why? I would, actually, that's not true. That's not true. I went to visit a friend at their university. And they, they were, like, pretty heartbroken because they lived with people that lived like this. And the kitchen was the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my life. It was absolutely repulsive. Um, and these people, they, they all lived like it. And my friend was kind of stuck. She had a tidy room and she didn't, she couldn't bear to use the kitchen. So she always ate out. Every, ev everything she had, she would eat out somewhere else. She wouldn't eat in the house. It, it was just too much. She couldn't cope with it. Um... And that, that was kind of the level of absolute repulsion and uh, you know, revulsion and disgust that she had for the place. It was it was pretty grim. Um, I, I did feel for her living there. I, I felt genuinely sorry for her living like that. Um, but yeah, uh, she, she, only ma she only had to live there with them for six months and then she managed to find another place to live so she's able to move out. She was very pleased. It was a very happy day in her life when she was able to move out from that lot. Um, where's the rest of the dirt? I'm thinking it's actually, you know, it says 84% clean. I think that it's actually in the, the room next door. I think that's what's causing it. So if we go here a minute and we will buy a radiator. We'll let that one right there and we'll put that one on the wall. Assemble. And then we'll lower that one into place. So yeah, it will, it'll just speed up all of these connection bits by 20, 40%, whatever it is. When we, if we get that final perk. Turn that one on and do that one up. Right. 84%. I, yeah, I'm, I'm fairly certain it's, um, oh, it's, it's behind here. 
I wonder if it's... Oh, ooh. I wonder if it's... I wonder if there's anything to do with those. Let's move them over. Well, I don't see anything. I reckon it is. I reckon it's this bathroom next door. We'll have a look in here. This this is the... Oh, oh. This this is... um. Okay, this, this is probably... What have you done to the sink? No. <laughs> oh, that's just... No. Oh, what have they done in here? I, I don't even want to know. I do not want to know what the substances are that I am busy cleaning off of this um the, the, these walls and stuff right now. Uh, 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 no. Oh, look at it. It's all around the toilet. It's... It, uh, oh. No, I, I genuinely do not want to know. I, I don't want to know. Devs, if you're watching... Please do not ever tell me what it is that I've just cleaned off this toilet because it, it's just going to be too much. There are some things man is just not meant to know. It's, it's as simple as that. Um, now, we've got a whole load of dirt over here. There is masses and masses and masses of dirt here. Uh, there's more up there all around the roof and around the ceiling. And there's, there's bits here. Oh, no, there's, there's more dirt there. 100% uh, clean dirt. Let me go into this room now. What do we got in here? And that is clean as well. So it was that one. There is one window that we've got to do. One final window. We're going to do this. We're, we're going to finish this job completely. We're going to get this whole house done. Because then once we've done this whole house, that is it. We don't need to worry about uh, ever coming back here again. Um, you can do the jobs again if you want to. You can go back through You can as a way to like earn quick money. Or you, yeah. Hey, go, you go into the archive. And you get to, like, go and do them again. See if you can do it in a faster time. Um, just, like, if you weren't able to complete it to 100% the first time you did it, you can go back over and you can do it again. Uh, get it to 100% so that you've got them all completed. There we go. The final window in this place. We've got a device that we need to mount there. Is that a sink? Oh, washer. Buy a washer and mount it here. And then we want a radiator to mount it there. So tooltips are very good. I like the fact that we have tooltips. Tooltips are wonderful. So we put that one on there. There we go. And that side. And then we put this one up on here. And we put that bit on there. And that bit on there. And that one up there. And then we go on there. We unscrew those. Take that one off. And that one. And then we need a washer. We just need a... where well, you can buy a washer. Right. Where is a washer? Home electronics. Computer. Computer Fenix. I don't think it's that. Home appliances. This one. There, gas stove, electric heater, double uh, induction cooktop, refrigerator, water heater, water uh, mountable washer. It's got to be that one. It's absolutely got to be that one. There we go. Uh, that appears to be where I've got to do. Yes, that is the one. So this one, you've got to take these bolts out. Can I do it from there? Apparently, I can only do them when they're highlighted on this one. Uh, you've got to take these out so that you can take out these big screws which hold the drum in place. This is what happens when you get a new washing machine delivered, um, or you go and buy one. Uh, you've got these huge, great big bolts. So you take that one off like that. And these bolts, they actually, you take them out. You take them out completely, and then you don't ever use them again. You can chuck them away, or if you, you think you're likely to move house in the next 10 years, then hold on to them. Because when you go to move the washing machine again, you put these in, and it locks the drum in place and stops it from moving around. However, there isn't actually any need to remove the back plate to do it. You can just take the bolts out. It, it, I suppose you could just to double check that everything's all right, but uh, yeah, you don't you don't need to. You don't need to remove that back plate. So we want to take that one. What am I doing? Oh, down there. Look there. See, it was lit up. I missed that bit. And we put that one on there. And then we take that one. Oh no, we got to put that one in. That would help. Yes, that that would be a good help. Put that one up on there and do that one up like that. There we go. And then we got that one there, which would be the waste pipe. And done. 100% complete. We actually did it. I didn't think we would. Now, look at this. Look at that kitchen now. Are you not proud to be a part of this? I mean, you've seen it when we first moved here. I, I for one, I'm proud that I was a part of this, that I was able to transform it into what it is right now. Um, Just those students are never coming back. Tell me those students are never, ever coming up. £4,264 for that job. That's not bad. And we earned three grand on the last job. £7,000 in a single day. That's not a bad day's work.
That's not bad at all, actually. I would say that that is something that we can give ourselves a pat on the back for. And, you know, a little, a little bit of self-congratulation is definitely in order. Right. Let's go in and have a look. So we've got £38,800. We'll have a look in here. How many... We've got four males. So we do have one new one. Open. There. Necessary extra bathroom. Bathroom and home workshop. Clean up the house, please. Aunt's home to redecorate. Save me from these horrible colours. Honey. Right. We're going to come back to those. So... I'm, I genuinely don't know if we should keep working through those or if we should go for a house now. I'm, I'm not actually sure. Uh, I think that we will probably... I don't know. But before I record the next episode, you will see this one. So you can give me your thoughts and opinions. You can tell me if you think that I should keep working through those jobs that we've got. Or should I try and buy a house? We've got 38 grand. We have enough. We've got a couple of houses that we can choose from. We can go and try and do that. But if you've enjoyed this episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.